Let epsilon naught denote the dimensional formula of permittivity of vacuum. If M is mass, L is length, T is time and A is electric current. Then take the formula of electrostatic force. Electrostatic force is equals to 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught. Q1, Q2 by R square. Where Q1 and Q2 are charges. R is the distance of separation between the charges and Fe is the electrostatic force of attraction or repulsion in between the charges. From this formula, epsilon naught is equals to take Q square by Fr square. 4 pi is constant, no need to take here. Epsilon naught is equals to Q square by Fr square. Electric current I is equals to Q by T and from this Q is equals to I T. Dimensional formula of charge is current is denoted with dimension A and time is T. A T this is the dimensional formula of charge and dimensional formula of force is unit of force kg meter per second square. So kg dimension mass m power 1, l power 1, t power minus 2. This is the dimensional formula of force. Now simplify this. In place of charge square, a power 2, t power 2. And in place of force, m power 1, l power 1, t power minus 2. And distance square L square. Here L power 1, L power 2, it become L power 3. So mass goes to numerator, M power minus 1 and the length goes to numerator, it becomes L power minus 3 and the T power minus 2 goes to numerator, then it becomes T power plus 4 and A square is there. This is the dimensional formula of permittivity of vacuum. First option is correct.